Hello, welcome. Today we're looking at Zetings. Zetings is a free tool that allows you to add interactivity to your presentation so that you can add a poll or something that enables you to check the understanding or engagement of your audience. So you start by clicking plus. I've already created one. Um, so we're going to go in and edit the one that I've created. Just wait for that to load up. And when you click the plus sign, you can add content by uploading a PowerPoint or PDF, which is what I've done. You can also create a poll, add a YouTube video, embed some content, a web link, and create a slide. So I've already done the first bit. So we're going to add a poll. And it's very easy. You could, uh, If you want to upload a PowerPoint or a PDF, you click on there. You choose your file, and it uploads. And then you can edit the order of the slides. You can't edit the slides, but you can edit their order and delete surplus ones. I want to now add a poll so we'll go in and you've got a number of different polls to choose from I'm going to go with a thumbs up and thumbs down one and then you can say yes or no under the thumbs up and thumbs down on the paid version, you can upgrade and alter the color, but I'm happy with it being bright orange, and we can click Create. We can then tick the box, and we can move it before, and we can just enter in the slide we'd like to move it in. So let's say we want to put it in four, and go. And it's positioned it there for me. Again, I'm going to add some more content, this time a YouTube video. I've got my YouTube link already just off screen so I'll paste that in and add and again I can tick the box and move it uh, to where I want it to go so just before slide 8 and go so it's very easy to to move content around finally I'm going to add another poll this time I'm going to go with a scale uh, or rank let's see you can Function's very similar. Um, So you can add your question, your various answers. Again, as I mentioned, you can't change the color because that's only in the premium versions and you can click create and then you can tick the box and you can move it to the location where you want it to appear. So let's say before slide 11 and click go. So there we have it. We've created our presentation. We can click send. And we can put that link there. Uh, Zetings are typically set to public, but that's fine. I'm happy with mine being public. Uh, and you can copy that link just to, so others can see what it looks like. We, we copy that link and just paste it in. It's coming back to me, but the viewers would be able to see that. Uh, if I click present, I click start presenting. I, it works just like you'd expect it to. I can navigate through. People can respond. I can see that response live. And there we have it. So they are Zetings, a really great way, easy way to add interactivity and audience participation to your presentations. Thanks for watching. Join me again soon.